Okay, today we're in the car. We're about to go to Hobby Lobby. I'm on my lunch break. I have 45 minutes, basically 40 minutes by the time I get there. Um, I'm gonna check like how much these beads are. And then I'm also gonna go to Joann's and Michael's just to see like who has the best price before I commit because I have a lot of beads to buy. I'm trying to recreate this little bra. I'm gonna pop it in. Because although I love this girl, I think she's so cute, so nice on the internet. And I would love to support a black business. I cannot pay $800 for this little beaded situation that I'm really only going to wear once, probably for less than an hour on this Hawaii trip. So, yeah, if we can get this done for like $40, I've won. So that's what we're going to try to do right now. I sent the picture to my mom. My mom was like, yes, you can do that. So here we are. I got all the confidence I needed. My mama said I could, so I know I can. Amen. Um, I also have this like waist trainer on. I feel like it looks dumb. Can you see it? Can you tell? I feel like everybody can tell, but my commitment to being snatched, I don't care about the judgment. Because when I'm out in my crop top, when I'm out in my dress, it's not gonna matter. Hobby Lobby, let's go. I really don't like supporting these fundamentalist Christians with my money, but we don't have a lot of other choices. Excuse me. Where are the beads? The beads, like, they look for like the bracelet ones and to make yeah, the Yeah, yeah. Okay. Totally on the wrong side. We have the wires and stuff here. Okay, cool. All the beads and stuff right here. Okay. All right, cool. Thank you. Yeah, come have a good day. Is this all the beads you have? Um, you might want to check the next aisle and the aisle after. That's what other jewelry makes. Got it. Thank you. Okay. Boom! These beads are fifty percent off. I like it. Do they have any of the beads? I need them. So I for sure need these. And I need like a good amount of them. I might. I don't know. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Let's see how much this is. All right, I was able to get like a small amount of beads for $25 which is making me like rethink this project and if it's worthwhile at all and if I should just abandon ship because yeah I'm basically not getting lunch this week at work Ugh, I hate that this is like all dirty my husband spilt a soda or like opened a soda and the car exploded anyways so yeah it's making me rethink this little bead journey because again what am I gonna do with this after the fact like I don't know. I just might end up returning these beads. I don't I really don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. This is when you need like a good friend. 
that can tell you if something is stupid or like worthwhile but I really pride myself on my outfits and like my ability to go the extra mile sometimes for a certain outfit and I just don't know sometimes oh okay we might have found a justifiable reason right now so if I do go through with this make this bralette thing whatever i could repurpose it into something for amina potentially i don't know what it would be but i could do that that's just a could i really could also what you do not take into account when you like start these diy is all of the other materials that you need to make this like clasp wire eh, 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 and it's like this could easily end up being a hundred dollar project still way cheaper than the 800 to like just buy it already done still way cheaper than that but i don't know i feel like i'm gonna text christian and i'm gonna ask christian if it's stupid am i being ridiculous and then if he says yeah this is stupid then i'm just gonna return these bees that i got abandon this whole idea and then post this vlog for personal responsibility so y'all know like all your ideas are not good ideas they don't have to be carried out but right now i'm so on the fence it's just in my mind though like the picture of me in hawaii like cute jean cut off shorts or bikini bottom with this top on is just ingrained in my mind for whatever reason and i don't know if i'll be able to shake it now also i'm hungry because I missed out on getting my panini today, which would have easily been like $13. Um, because I wanted to buy the stuff to make this a little top. So, if I'm hungry for no reason, like, what are we doing? The life of being a middle class person, basically poor person in America, is so sad. Like, you really have to choose between, I'm going to do something creative or I'm going to get lunch. The people that have won at life and are not having to work for their living, every day I shed a single tear because I'm not one of you. Like, why did I not get chosen to be adopted by Lionel Richie? Here we go. Let's see what kind of bees they got up in here.
So I only ended up getting these because they were the only ones on sale. All the other ones were not $3.99. It was a scam, it was a lie. So I feel like I need to go back to Hobby Lobby or try Michael's, that's what my mom said. Now I have to go to the grocery store. One of my least favorite things to do. But here we are, at least I got one good addition to the beaded bra today. We'll see how this goes. I have until basically May 18th to finish this project because our plane flies on May 19th. And I'm not about to put these beads together on the plane, you know? So we got until May 18th right now. It is April 26th. So I have kind of a little bit of time. I also have a ton of other things going on. I got book club. I'm doing this business plan for my grandma. I have a very hectic posting schedule with all of my social media uh, tasks. So we're gonna do our best. I have not washed my clothes yet this week. So yeah, a lot of things are going undone, if you will. But at least I'm going to the grocery store, so I'll have cookies and I will have LaCroix to sip on and get me through this traumatic time. I got these stupid ass groceries. Why is A1 sauce basically like eight, nine dollars? I'm not, you know, a super supermarket sweep type of bitch, but has it always been this expensive? I do not recall A1 being like the price of a whole chicken. This is getting out of hand. I'm no Trump supporter, but goddamn Joe Biden, like what is going on up there, Grandpa? Fix this. On my thousandth trip to Hobby Lobby for this, whatever it is I'm making at this point, bralette, beaded thing. However, a lot of celebrities have been seen wearing this now. So I feel like I'm very on trend. And just when I was gonna abandon it, I saw her post Megan Fox in Sports Illustrated and I saw Kali Uchi's tour outfit. So now I'm committed. I've already bought all this stuff. Now I need like clasp. So Hobby Lobby. All of this suburban chic. It's nasty. All right. We've succeeded. My hair looks stupid, but I'm going to leave on Friday to Hawaii with Jasmine and Melvina, so I'm not like doing my hair or anything until that point. Um, because why, you know? Look at these people, I don't care. All right, I put like a white sheet over my bed, so maybe it'll help the color stand out more, but this is where we're at right now. I did not film this part because it was super duper hard. I'm not gonna bullshit you. I had to like, also because I'm not a good pre-planner I just start a project and figure like I'll work my way through it I could have easily like measured my um waist or whatever or upper bust I don't know what it's called and then cut a, a bead wire and did the but I didn't do that okay I did all of this measuring it on my body because I wanted it to fit precisely I've never made anything like this before and I was like nervous kind of neurotic about it and also very non-committal like the whole time I was doing it I wasn't sure if it was gonna work so I didn't uh, yeah the confidence was not there but here you go don't look at my nail Ugh, my nails look so ugly okay we need to do something about that but anyways these are the nails of a bee worker so boom you got that little part I hooked it on you see I just like spun around and around and around did the same thing to connect this arm and I also did count the beads out because like when one arm worked and then I tried to copy on the other side, it didn't work. Um, so I had to count it out. So boom, we got 10 on that side, 10 on the other side. You can see here, like I didn't, finish, I didn't finish fully attaching this part, but I'll do that in a second. I just wanted to show y'all basically how I did it. On this side, I really just roped and roped and roped around and made this little loop because I knew that's what I would need. And again, I was not sure about this project, the budget for it, nothing. What I was gonna, I was tired of going to Hobby Lobby. So they do have, like they do sell, this little part if you don't want to buy it but yeah I bought this little piece today when I went very clutch before I was holding on with a safety pin and it was giving me like an altered measurement for how it was gonna fit so luckily it does fit perfectly and now we need to layer some of the beads that I got so I really really like turquoise 
in blue that's my vibe i feel like blue is my favorite color i just watched uh rupaul's uh architectural digest video today and he was like he found out at 36 whatever that he really really loved orange so he decided to live in orange like he lives inside of a hermes box i feel like my color is really blue it hasn't my whole life my mom thought i was gonna be a little boy so like my first room and all that was blue so i really really just love blue tones of blue i really like a darker more ocean vibe relaxed and overall that is my goal for life for my life is to just be like water i want to be peaceful and calm but like strong enough to fuck something up if i need to so yeah that's the vibe mm. okay do we like that i think i like that i also have these little like cool rocks for the edges We'll see how that goes. Honestly, I have to get more. Like I said, I was like non-committal about this and very freaked out. And then I have these two pieces. I was gonna use for like a top part like that, but I don't really like that idea now. I think I just want a straight across vibe. Really, I wanted the top piece because I like that cut on my body. I don't like my like upper chest. I feel like I have a lot of empty space. If you've ever seen that episode of the Kardashians where Kendall was like, it's just so far and then chris said it's a lot of space for diamonds i felt that in my soul and then i have these like rose quartz pieces i can put in so honestly i don't really know how i'm gonna like layer and do that but and i don't know if i should mix i really don't want to because i like the idea of like how this looks right now i like that of course not this one where did this paint come from on my beads? Girl, hell no. I feel like it was in the bag because it was also on these too, but I like rubbed it off. Anyways, I really like the way that's looking and that's flowing. So I'm gonna put these on strings. I'm gonna have to use these on the edges. Boop. And yeah, let's see how far I can get. But I really need like a barrage beads right there so i probably need like one two four more strings of beads the problem is though when i'm at the store it's really hard for me to find like beads that i like that i feel like go with this i'm trying to stay with the theme but then i see the other ones that she made and like sometimes they have a theme sometimes they don't sometimes they're all over the place i don't really know i was just talking but we'll see what i can come up with okay so i was already at home with the fact that i wouldn't finish it before i got there so here i am on the plane trying to put this together a little bit i did what i could Good. also i didn't measure a lot with this and that caused me a little bit of extra pain but oh well here i am in the hotel finishing it up so i can finally take my pics you see the party <laughs> things have gone crazy already here we are on the final day of the trip and basically right before we leave to the airport i am staging up the balcony to take my picture and just all of the work that i've done on this i think the final cost is 64 dollars and 81 cents including all the tools because i didn't have any like needle nose pliers and all the small stuff you need to make this i would give this project a 10 i would definitely make it again and be better also if i were to make this again i would definitely take my time and measure out everything so it was less time consuming and less annoying um but i definitely love the look i would probably make some bottoms or some sort of like belly chain shorts chain to go with it $65 compared to $800 plus shipping and handling is a steal to me though. So let me know what you think about this project in the comments if you will recreate and don't forget to subscribe.